Welcome to the Testing for Constant Variance and Regressions Models tutorial. In this tutorial, you'll learn how to test for constant variance and regression models using SAS and using the Broich Pagan test. Broich Pagan test looks to see if there's any relationship between the independent variables and the variance or the residual squared. All right, in front of me, you'll see that I have the PROC reg statement, my standard regression statement. And notice that here I have a plot. I'm going to plot the residuals versus the price so that I can look at it. Now, this data is the same data I've used in other tutorials. However, it's not the transform data. So first thing I'm going to do is run this and look at the output. Now, when I look at the residual plots, I look and I see that, number one, there's still a pattern in this data. Also, I notice that there is a lot of variation over here, but as I move off to the right, there becomes less and less variation. So what I want to do is be able to test my assumption of constant variance, and that's what the Broich Pagan test will do. I'm going to close this. Here is my standard regression output r squared of 0.91. Somebody would say, well, that looks great. All right, so what I'm going to need to do for this is I'm going to need an output statement. I've covered output statements in previous tutorials. If you need to learn about those, go look at that tutorial. I'm going to name it demand out. And in particular, I need the residuals. From there, I'm going to use a data step. I've done a data step in a previous tutorial. If you need to learn about data steps, go look at that one. This one I'm going to call demand out to. And the set that I'm reading in from is demand out. I'm going to need two things. I'm going to need the residuals. So I'm going to call it res2 is equal to residuals squared. And I'm also going to need price, which is my independent variable, squared, in order to determine whether there's a relationship at all. And I'm going to run this. And after that, I'm going to use regression again. That's what the Broich Pagan test does. Except this time, the data that I'm going to import is demand out 2. My model is going to be residual squared is equal to price and price squared. I'll run this and then I will quit. Now this all together will give me the Broich Pagan test. All right. We've already looked at the residual plot. Here is the Broich Pagan test. Notice it says dependent variable is res2, residual squared. So this is my Broich Pagan test. Also notice that I have price and price2 as my variables. So this is actually a quadratic regression. Now, if I go over and look at the p values, the one that I'm interested in is this one up here, specifically because it tests both coefficients simultaneously equal to zero to test if there's any relationship. Not what the relationship is, but is there any relationship? And then from this, you see that the p-value is very, very small. The null hypothesis in the broich pagan test is that the residuals are or do have constant variance. The alternative is they do not have constant variance, in particular that they're related to the predictor or the independent variable. In this case, the p-value is very small, so that would mean we would reject the null hypothesis and assume that we have non-constant variance. Well, this has been testing constant variance in SAS tutorial. If you have any other questions, please ask or watch this tutorial again.